Hi, I'm doing a review on this Red Wing construction boot. Um, I would say steel toe, but uh, this doesn't have steel in it, it's a uh, composite material. Um, I purchased these of my first Red Wing boots. Um, I was doing a lot of construction and um, I needed something uh, a new pair of boots because uh, I used to buy uh, some of the ones at Walmart and some of those places and they served their purposes but um, they were not I used to f my legs and stuff used to hurt a lot after working and a friend of mine recommended this that uh, uh, recommended looking at Red Wings um, and believe me the, the, the sticker price is really um, you know threw me for the loop but um, after doing a lot of research on the company and at the time I was uh, big on American made shoes uh, unfortunately these Red Wings were made in China um, but it was the only one they had in the store that fit my purposes and I have to say these are the most comfortable boots or shoes I've ever owned and um, I would assume any shoe that Red Wing make carry the same technology for um, for comfort I wore these the first day I wore these no breaking period when I came home I had no stress on my feet my calf muscles, my quads, my butt, everything was just relaxed. There was no pain, zero pain. Um, work, they are heavy because they are construction boots, they, they are heavy. But I, I would take the weight of these things over any lightweight boot that um, put stress from impact on my my bones and joints um, and, and muscles too the only other pair of shoes that came close to these um, I did a review on the Corkers uh, snow jack those are really comfortable but I have never worn those for the length of time that I've worn these so Red Wing is doing something right and I don't work for Red Wing um, I'm just doing the review because I'm sure there are people out there who um, who might benefit from this just like I benefited from those that reviewed other boots um, other uh, that I um, was able to draw upon grip is really good on the other soul uh, on the sole, there's a Vibram sole, really doesn't mean anything to me. Um, apparently, it's supposed to be really good with that, but as far as the comfort of these shoes, they're incredible. I did not buy the extra insole um, because I tried it and it was it felt uncomfortable to me. Um, but the soles that these came with, the insoles, they were fine for me. Some other some people may need the uh, uh, the other insole. It's supposed to give you more comfort it just didn't for me um, I did another review on the on this VASC Ultra SST I know I said VASC on the video uh, the correct uh, word for this is VASC um, I'll just have to go back and redo that video if someone be, you know become kind of hell-bent on on the details of the pronunciation of that um, those yellow ones they're really comfortable too sister company to red wing same company just a different branch and again we got the the corker snow jack um very close runner to this um but it's a, it's a different application and i don't really wear those as uh for long periods of time but i wore these these are really really good boots uh, there are some reviews out there some really bad um, uh, Red Wing boots 
uh, it fell apart and things of that nature. Uh, Red Wing has warranties on, on their their boots, so um, you know keep the receipt and uh, the box and um, if something like that occurs, you know, let's take it back to the store. But um, I would assume if you buy these from an authentic store, um, there typically isn't any pro issue issues with them. This is my, however, this is my first and only Red Wing boot for a number of years before I got these and um, these trail runners type things. And they've held up for me. Uh, so these are a size eight, which is my size. Good fit, very comfortable. A lot of room up front, um, so, so the toes can spread. Um, it's roomy enough where you know your feet swell. It um, it really conforms. So hopefully these help. And um, thanks for looking at my video.